Welcome back to another episode of Southern Bell Unboxing. I, of course, am Rhonda Hernandez, and this episode is all about Disney, and with the exception of one figure, which is MGM. But <laughs> um, so, just to start things off, uh, a few weeks back, remember we went to uh, the Disney store in Spring, I believe it was, or Katy, one of the cities. I don't know, doesn't matter. But um, so they had a sale going on for Halloween, basically, where you buy one figure and you get one free right that's what it was no no, no two for nine that's mm. what it was so normally well i guess it's the same because they're normally 18 dollars mm. so you buy two and you get it for nine dollars each which is basically buy one get one free so <laughs> that store had basically all the princesses and some of their their uh, male prints or whatever parts so checking out I've made a comment to the cashier. I was like, oh, I wish I really had Beast. She's like, oh, we did. She goes, we just sold out of it. So she's like, oh, you can always go to another store and get it. So I called the store by us anyways. They were like, yeah, we haven't had that in months. But you can go online. So that's what I did. I went online and I actually got a counterpart that I had wanted to get in the store. But I was like, mm, no. But <laughs> um, so I'm going to go ahead and unbox this one. So obviously, because I ratted it out last week. So I was getting Beast, and today we got Beast already. So I'm kind of excited because I already got Belle, and previously I had gotten Pocahontas. So now, ooh, that is so pretty. Look at the tissue paper. I think I'm gonna be like a hoarder and save that. <laughs> <laughs> so now that I've cut the tape and I've opened up the box and pulled the tissue paper. So I will go ahead and show you the Beast first. So. He is freaking cute. Mm -hmm. I love it. Is that a good angle? Yeah, no, I, I'll move around. Yeah, okay. So, yeah, so he's very huge compared to Belle and all the other figures. He's the biggest figure that they had. So, I was very surprised he was included in the sale because he is so large. But he is gorgeous. And I love that he's the original beast. Now, with his, like, I guess, mane or beard you want to call it it's a little awkward looking for me it's a little like more like triangular like almost like uh, egyptian like but i still i love it um he definitely is the kinder side of his face so i'm gonna go ahead and spin it just around for you real quick that's cool yeah so he is adorable and i love that they put the little scenes from the the movie as well and then the next figure, which is the one I seriously debated on getting between this and Pocahontas, um, but I said on Pocahontas because she was more my favorite than this one, but because of the sale, I went and got her anyways. So I got Jasmine, and she's got a boo, which now that I think about it, it's kind of awkward because Aladdin should have a boo, and Jasmine should have Raja. But, you know, I'm not the creator, so... <laughs> But I, I do. I absolutely adore it. You know what? I didn't even look. I, she didn't, they didn't have her, uh, him on there. So, but I love that she's got her little princess outfit on and her gold earrings. I always wanted to have gold earrings like that. <laughs> so I'm going to show that. Oh, she's gorgeous. But, so I got her and him. And... So, and to also add to my Disney video, um, is this here. Now, these were ordered from Walmart.com, but they're not Walmart products. They are from Tom's Model. So, we don't know how great their shipping quality is. I mean, the box seems pretty secure and all that. And it's got protective stuff on it, which is nice. But, we got, ooh. I'm just going to unbox it like this. Ta-da! Nice. Not bad. Not bad. All right. So, um, of course, you all know I'm a huge, huge fan of Beauty and the Beast. And this completes my set. <laughs> so, I'm cutting myself off. The only pop I did not get from the new movie was any of the new beasts. Just because I don't like the figuration of his face. Um, and then the new characters. I got all the bells except for one, which is Celebration Bell with her in the white dress with the peach flowers. Um, that's the only bell I didn't get. All the other ones I did. So to complete this set, 
I got Lumiere. And um, he's gorgeous. I love him. He's so cute. I love his little flames and his uh, candlesticks. And he's just... I wish that they gave him a mouth, though. That's my only critique on this. No mouths have mouths. <laughs> he has no mouth. But, I mean, that's... Lumiere's iconic annoyingness is his mouth. So, But, um, so I got this. And I have not seen him in the wild, I'll say. <laughs> well, we have. I remember it was really? busted. Yeah, we saw the Toys R Us. In the, oh, uh, that's right. It was busted. Yeah. But I did get... That oh, I haven't seen. Oh, oh no, it's just fuzzies. Okay. So here is gonna be Mrs. Pot and Chip, and um, yeah. So this is absolutely love. I love Mrs. Pot and Chip, and uh, actually JC was Chip for Halloween this year. Uh, we actually didn't get to go trick or treating on Halloween night because he was sick, and poor baby, he really was sick. He he came home from school early, slept, and still didn't want to go later. But uh, I love Chip. I love his his whole like little innocent face on this and mrs potts bless her heart she looks so tired in this <laughs> pop mold but now i have every one on the back yeah, um i got that. cogsworth and peasant bell both from box lunch mm -hmm. and um i have seen mrs potts and chip um in the wild before at box lunch at box... no wasn't that the movie version well, that that's the movie version, yeah. But um, no. I saw Box Lunch before, or, or this before. But we, I just decided not to get it. But no, I, I did, I, I did want it. Um, to kind of separate real quick from the pops and stuff, but um, still being the beast. Um, we found this one at. Target. Who? Target. 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 Oh my gosh. So we found Chip at Target. Um, Carlos found for me Mrs. Potts at Target a few weeks back, and then now we found Chip. And he's adorable. I love his little nose. Um, and he also has his little chip, so it's really cute. Um, also, I caved in just because I found the other ones. <laughs> I went and I got Lumiere. And before, y'all have heard me say Lumiere does not look like Lumiere. And I still don't think he does. I think he looks like a fish. <laughs> but <laughs> I got him just to complete the set. And he's, he's common. He's in every single store we ever come into. But um, he's adorable still. So that and this one here he's not Beauty and the Beast but I saw him and I've never seen him before and I love it Sebastian. it's Sebastian and I wonder if they do have the Tsum Tsum of um, Flounder and uh, mm -hmm. Ariel yeah, they do okay uh, well I've never seen them if I did see them I don't remember I don't them, remember them. Yeah, I don't remember yeah, them. I but yes yeah, so I found Sebastian and he's adorable I, I love him so much <laughs> Um, so to keep going with the Beauty and the Beast scene, um, movie version of Peasant Belle. And she was going online whenever she first came out for quite a bit, right? Wasn't yeah. it like 60 or 70 yeah. something? Yeah. And, um, she just came back up on Walmart's website and I'll admit the box is busted. It's, it's not in great shape at all. Um, you gotta flip. Yeah corner here it's bent here it's kind of bubbled and, and bent on the back but um i i just had to have her she's a walmart exclusive and um yeah she completes my 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 urge to collect these <laughs> <laughs> but uh, i do i i love the set here she's she's really pretty um so to kind of separate from disney beauty and the beast now i'm gonna go with mary poppins and she is not in a Mary Poppins set herself. She's in a, a joint series set with a variance of other ones. But um, out of this set here on the back, I don't plan on getting any of them but her. Um, I love that she's got her bag and her umbrella bird. And this is the, the beginning scene where she just comes in and meets the kids. So I, I love this scene so much. I love this movie. Genie is not bad. Oh yeah, the genie. Oh yeah, so I can take a quick look here. Genie and Jafar probably would be the only ones I would get. Oh, out of, oh, yeah, I already Jasmine. have Jasmine. Yeah, yeah, Jasmine. yeah, I have the the newest version of Jasmine. Oh yeah, that Rocketeer. Rocketeer? Yeah, I want the Rocketeer. Though. I don't even know where that's from. Uh, keep going. <laughs> In right. Rocketeer. Yeah. Hold on, yeah. So I got Mary Poppins, um, and then along with the Mulan that I had gotten. Oh. 
Jasmine. I don't know all that. I got the, the new princess version. Um, I went ahead and I got Mulan. And I love Mulan. She has such an amazing story in that movie and such a strong female presence that Disney really changed for princesses, I believe, with her. Um, she's, she's gorgeous. She is in her, um, this was her uh, wedding uh, presentation where she's supposed to find a, a husband. And um, I, I really love this version of her. <laughs> um, so now, just to kind of wrap it up with Beauty and the Beast real quick before I present the non-Disney item. Um, of course, you know with Hot Topic, they're always some type of catch. You spend this much money, you get hot cash. So I got me another Beauty and the Beast button of them dancing and then another bell with uh, Mrs. Pot and Chips. Chips. Chip. Chips. <laughs> so I got that. Um, so now this. This was one of the first movies I remember seeing that was a musical and I loved it. And so does everybody else. 1939's The Wizard of Oz. And this is a vinyl figure and I love the details with these. And this is actually uh, Dorothy Gale with Toto and the Scarecrow. Um, I have not seen any other version of this yet so I'm pretty sure if they do make one it's going to be the Cowardly Lion with um, the Tin Man and what would be really cool is if they had the wizard himself yeah. with one of the witches or Glinda and stuff I mean there's there's an unlimited not unlimited, there, there's a good variety that they could do with these figures for this movie but I just had to have this version I, I love it but uh yeah so this is my Disney set along with exclusive of one MGM um, so yeah, y'all definitely have a great day and look forward for more videos to come. Y'all have a good one.